g'day I've just reached 500 subscribers and I'd like to say a big thank you to everybody that watches my videos in this video we're making some headed steel pins from free cutting steel you can see we're holding the steel in a 5c collet we're actually cheating a bit because we're using a half inch 5c collet to hold 12 more steel which makes it a bit easier to release because in fact if you use a 12 mil collet to hold 12 mil steel it can be very difficult to get it to come forward when you've parted off the previous part And if you're wondering what that is, it's a finger grip, so you can get hold of the finger, pull it forward. That finger grip was made early on in the piece when we were, I was making them at the start, and it's a bit deeper than I ended up making it later. That's the Sumitomo FC insert that I use virtually use it for everything even use it on aluminium and it works well and that's the Sumitomo 2 mil wide parting tool I use it's a low cutting force insert with up to 30 degrees rake right in the middle of the insert which makes it very easy on the machine that you're using That lets you see how it works. Started using that after someone had actually suggested that you could do that and automate the whole process by having a gripper move into that groove and pull the thing forward automatically. But for this job of just 300 pins, it was hardly worthwhile. As the captain says, that's a Noga spray unit. They are really expensive. But they work. Sorry, I had to include that. That is just unreal that that actually managed to put that part there. Now when you have a look at this you'll see I'm turning the nib off before facing because I've found at times that if you just face that off when the insert gets there you break the end off the insert. So by doing that and just turning it away there's not much of it there for the point of the insert to run into. And as you can see tidying it up and making it nice looking job didn't take that long so it was well worthwhile there you go that's the parts finished and thank you for watching and thank you to all my subscribers